I'm Dr. Archana Pathak. I'm Director of Obstetrics and Gynecology at CK Birla Hospital, West Punjabi Bagh. So today we are going to discuss about early pregnancy, what to expect. So as soon as the diagnosis of pregnancy is confirmed, uh, you may visit your doctor for a confirmation of the pregnancy and for that your doctor may advise you a blood test of pregnancy which is called a serum beta HCG. Once we make a diagnosis of pregnancy, then uh, you may discuss with your doctors the frequent common symptoms which you are going to probably uh, see during your pregnancy in the early first few months. So. Uh, Many women, you know, when they are diagnosed with pregnancy, they start experiencing nausea and vomiting sensation. Nausea and vomiting is very common. Some people may not experience it, experience it at all. Some may have little bit of problem in the morning. Some may have it in the evening and some have it throughout the day. So uh, with consultation of your doctor, you can be given some tablets to counter this feeling of nausea and vomiting. Also, it is absolutely normal to have, uh, you know, try certain home remedies for this. You can start your day with maybe a dry thing like a glucose biscuit, a rasa or something. Don't start your day with liquids. Also, you, once you experience the feeling of nausea, you can, you know, uh, take some ginger juice or something. You can take uh, ice cubes and you can chew the ice cubes that prevents the feeling of nausea. There are certain medications to help you out with that you can take with your doctor's consultation. Also, a frequent and common symptom which many experience during pregnancy is unpleasant odors. You know, your heightened sensation to uh, feel any odor or an any pleasant smells. So this is absolutely normal. You should not be disturbed by it because there is nothing which we can do to prevent this feeling. So try and run it down and don't give it too much of importance. Also, some people experience constipation, which is absolutely normal. It is because of the effect of progesterone hormone. For this, you can increase your fluid intake. Also, take fiber-rich diet. Uh, in fact, it is better to divide your meal into six equal you know, portions. You should be taking major meals of breakfast, lunch and dinner, but you should be taking in between three small meals also and that would get, go a long way in preventing your nausea vomiting feeling your unpleasant odors and smells you know so you will be able to eat a balanced and healthy diet that way some people experience in fact many almost all experience frequency of uh, urination that's absolutely com normal because uh, the pregnant uterus which is growing puts pressure on the bladder and that leads to a frequent urination problem. Uh, you may notice some increase in your vaginal discharge which is absolutely normal because if you have seen that the discharge which is seen is mostly of uh, you know it's milky white in color and it does not itch or smell but anytime if you notice any itching or discharge which is smelly that is the time when you are going to consult with your doctor in fact there are certain times when you feel very tired breathless in your pregnancy this is absolutely normal because the body is preparing itself for the pregnancy changes and uh, there is shift in the heart position also which leads to breathlessness so it is absolutely normal so don't get disturbed by the feeling that you are not able to do your daily activities you feel lethargic you feel sleepy and there is general sense of uh, you know uh, laziness all around but this is just going to pass off in a few days some people experience little bit of cramping in the initial few days which is absolutely normal it's just like menstrual cramps so don't get alarmed by it so breast changes are absolutely normal and uh, this pain and uh, feeling of uh, tingling sensation or some tenderness in the breast is absolutely normal and you should not feel bad about it. Also there is uh, sometimes many pe people experience mood changes, emotional disturbances, you feel like crying all the time, you know your uh, husbands get disturbed by your uh, sudden change in your behavior, your mood, 
but I think a partner support goes a long way in this. There is no need to feel alarmed. You have not gone, you've not gone under any uh, drastic transformation. Uh, in fact, if you do yoga, meditation, if you lead a healthy lifestyle, a healthy diet, balanced diet, you know, that goes a long way in preventing all these symptoms and that leads to you coping up well in your early months of pregnancy. So I hope this video of mine finds you in best of your health during the pregnancy. If you have any queries, any doubts, you can visit me at CK Birla Hospital, West Punjabi Wag, during my uh, OPD hours. Thank you very much.